Yesterday we got a little skit featuring Ryan Reynolds and a lot of the other cast members from Free Guy that was telling us we're gonna get a trailer today. So here it is, we're gonna give it a watch, we're gonna talk a little bit about the movie, and this is a movie that stands out a little bit from other movies, seeing that it's an original idea and it's something that has a lot of people excited for the comedy behind it, the visuals behind it, and of course, Ryan Reynolds. So let's jump into the trailer. Good morning, Goldie. My name is Guy and I live in Free City. I have everything I need. Except one thing. Me. Hey. hey, bud, you ever think that there's got to be more? More than what? The stuff we do day after day. Literally not once. Today's going to be different, Goldie. What are we looking at? Who are you? We ran into each other the other day. How did you find me? I waited outside by the murder train. Guys, I have to tell you something. There is no easy way to say this. This world, it's a video game. I really want to kiss you. Is that weird? Listen to me. You're not real. Wait, you let who kiss you? Guy. That's so interesting. There's not a button for that. Oh, he found the button. <laughs> Ryan Reynolds. Can Buddy, find the if we're not real, doesn't that mean that nothing you do matters? I am sitting here with my best friend trying to help him get through a tough time. Now, if that's not real, I don't know what is. Millie, I know this world is just a game, but this place, these people, that's all I have. Thanks, guy. Who is this guy? This character in the video game Free City has been turning heads by being the good guy. Woo! Who is Blue Shirt Guy? You're absolutely right. Who is he or she? Indeed. This loser is ruining the game, <laughs> man. <laughs> I don't care if he's Arnold freaking Schwarzenbader. Terminate him. <laughs> 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 Guy, in two days, the game is going to shut down. You, this whole city, they'll be gone. What if we can save it? Was that cool? It felt really cool. We can change our world, but we have to fight together. I don't even know what's happening right now, but I love it! Woo! This is the first time I've ever driven a car before. I really wish you'd mention that. Yeah. Yeah. We love you, Blue Shirt Guy! Thank you! Watch out for the... <laughs> they seem nice. Cool. So yesterday in the little skit they gave us, they threw out a bunch of different release dates because obviously movies are getting pushed back frequently. We don't know when movies are going to be coming out with a surety. So we weren't 100% sure whether or not we were going to be getting this movie this year, next year, or whenever. And they threw out a ton of dates in this funny little skit. But it does say at the end of the trailer, December 11th. So something to look forward to. And from the trailer alone and from what we already know about the movie, this really is... Ready Player One meets the Lego movie meets Deadpool. And that's a fantastic combination of movies that is definitely something that a lot of people can get excited to go see in the theater and enjoy. It looks like it has a really cool good guy feel to it where this guy just wants to do good in the world and this world where everything he knows is repetitive, is people doing bad things to other people because it's a video game where people are pillaging the city he lives in. So that's really exciting to see. One, from just a humanity standpoint, and two, from it looks like a really funny, fun, upbeat movie that we really could use right now. Now, hopefully the December 11th release date actually sticks because we really need a movie. We really need movies to start coming back to the theater and obviously safety first. When I went and saw Tenet, it was very well managed. They had us in separate locations, weren't by anybody we didn't know. Social distancing was extremely important and they had all the other concession things which were high contact points closed down. So there's no reason why the people who feel comfortable to go to the theaters can't go and enjoy these movies. And as we are starting to see a little bit, movies are starting to set those more firm release dates. Now, a lot of them are starting to get pushed back just a little bit because people are nervous, one, about safety, and two, about whether or not the movies are gonna make enough money. Tenet's sitting at about 320 million right now, and 400 million needs to be hit to make even. And I don't doubt that it'll hit it, but it definitely is a little bit of a scare with such a high budget and a movie that definitely would have done 
so much better than that in the different circumstances. So although it's gonna take a little bit of time and patience for these movies to start rolling out regularly, we can hope to see a couple every now and then come out. And I think Free Guy would be a perfect pick for a movie to come out before the end of this year. So we can go and enjoy something in the theaters with our friends and families and the people who we're able to go to communitively and keep our distance from the rest. So let me know what you guys thought about this trailer. Ryan Reynolds, as always, is a gem to watch. He's a fantastic actor. He's very, very funny and uplifting, and he'll definitely get you in a good mood and get you laughing. So this movie's gonna have a very, very wonderful point in all of that. But let me know what you guys thought of the trailer when you saw it. Are you excited to see the movie? Is this something you really wanna see this year, or is this one of the movies you're fine letting kind of fall back into another date? Let me know in the comments down below. As always, thank you to everybody who watched till the very end of the video. If you found it helpful, useful, entertaining, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button as we're covering all major movie news right here on Cosmic Culture.